Welcome back, little beans. Warning, the following ASMR is only aimed for beans who are in need for comfort and positive energy from a favorite anime character. There won't be any NSFW versions of this ASMR. This is for all ages and is appropriate for all. However, if you feel uncomfortable from videos like this, then click off. To the ones who are staying, go right ahead and get all cozy in your blinkies, pop in your headphones, snack on some chocolate robots, and enjoy this ASMR. <laughs> what a fresh air. Finally out of that place. Now I can go out. Possibly go skateboarding or... I don't know. Do whatever hell I want. Huh, really quiet. I guess Mike is somewhere around here. Hmm. <laughs> the butlers are back in their headquarters. Looks like I have my way to escape. You know I can sense you. Yeah? Come out of the shadows. Well, well, well. If it isn't my favorite little butler. Listener. Let me guess. You knew I was gonna sneak out. <laughs> what, you want to come along with me? Or are you here to stop me? Which is it? Oh, <laughs> you actually came to stop me from walking out of my own home just to get some fresh air? Man, they must have really controlled you. Look, I'm a Zoldic. I get to do whatever hell I want. And that means disobeying my own mother. Yeah, of course I'm gonna be the head of the Zoldix one day. But I still wanna do my own thing. And the one thing I wanna do is to go out. And get some fresh air. Possibly go skateboarding or go to a candy store. Cause that's what I usually do on a Saturday night. Hmm? <laughs> And what are you going to do about it, listener? You know you can't stop me. I'm a Zoldic. I'll be doing anything to you. I can kill you really easily. You see these claws here? I can gut you out. Just in a second. I can gouge your heart out as well. You wouldn't want that. Do you, listener? <laughs> That's what I thought. Are you coming with me or not? <laughs> well, you're really taking your job really seriously. You do not want me to sneak out of my own home? Well, as your master Kilua, I'm gonna go out. And you, mind your own business. So, sayonara. Uh, 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 listener, what the hell? <laughs> you think pinning me against a tree would help, like, stop me? <laughs> oh, listener, you got a lot to learn. Pinning me against a tree isn't going to solve anything. Yeah. <laughs> Nice try, though. But you still gotta be even more sneakier than that. <laughs> Why do you have your hands around my waist? Hmm? What? So I can't do anything I want? You're just following my mom's orders? Come on, it's okay to slack off. I mean... As long as you're with me, you'll be fine. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Come on, how about I take you somewhere? Oh, come on, I don't think you've been there before. It's a lot to explore here in Kokoro Mountain. Yeah? Come on. Where am I taking you? 
Uh, you'll see. Oh, don't worry, it's not a trap or anything. And I'm not gonna kill you. Nah, I'd rather kill my brother and my mother than you. Uh, let's just say you're... Something. Yeah, that's all I'm gonna say, Baka. I'm gonna say you're something. Nothing else. Anyway, we're almost there. <sighs> Baka, I'm still not gonna tell you. I'm just gonna show you, and you just keep your mouth shut. Okay? Okay. Well, we're here. Yeah, we're on top of a mountain. Well, just a little hill. I usually like to come up here, you know, when I'm done fighting with my parents, especially my mom, or having some BS with my brothers, mostly Illumi and Maluki. I attempt to come up here just to clear my head. Yeah. No, I don't have anger issues. I mean, Maluki, on the other hand, and my mom. <laughs> you see where he gets it from, but... I'm just tired of the whole assassination thing and always talking about death and killing people. That's not my thing. I don't even want to. What do I really want to do? <laughs> I don't know. Life's a mystery for me. Someday, I always want to know what it's like to be normal. What was that? Oh. <laughs> You saying you're normal? How's your normal life outside of Kokoro Mountain? Eh, I mean, I wouldn't really care, but I am interested. Mm-hmm. Yeah? Huh, how interesting. So there's not a lot of killing where you're living. Hmm. I want to ask you this. Listener, why do you choose to be a Zoldic butler if you live such a normal life outside of this place? Hmm? Oh, come on, it's Master's orders. Tell me, why do you choose to be a butler? Hmm? Is it not just for the money? Did your parents force you to work at or the Zoldex. Or do your parents know about my family? Oh, there's another purpose. Am I correct, listener? If I'm correct, do you work here because you have a thing for me? <laughs> your face is turning red. Am I correct? The reason why you worked here is because you want to be near me. Is that it? Oh, I don't mind that you like me. I don't have my own preference. I mean, <laughs> you're the most cute looking butler I've ever seen. And around my age? That's quite rare. Oh yeah. I'm glad you work here, and I find that a good thing that you like me back. Yeah. <laughs> well, now that you mention it, it means I get to do this. Look up at me. <laughs> <laughs> Did you like that? Oh, shit! Oh. <laughs> you almost tripped. <laughs> you okay, listener? <laughs> Looks like you almost fell for me. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> oh, I'm just kidding. That didn't hurt me. <laughs> Oh man, that was really cute. I guess it was your first kiss from me, huh? 
Oh, I didn't mind. Uh, you're my first kiss. Uh, I think we should be heading back by now. I think I can sense my mom watching this. Mm-hmm. And Kaluto as well. Yeah, she's watching us. Come on. I'll send you back to the butler's domain. Mm-hmm. I guess you need to check out soon. Well, it was nice talking to you and stopping me from running away from home. Yeah, and... Thank you for being my first kiss. <laughs> oh, you're so cute. Alright, come on, let's head back. Well, good night, listener. Hope to see you tomorrow. Yeah. Why, Ma? Why can't you just leave me alone and just give me a break for once? You really like that boy, do you, Kill? Too bad you may not see him again tomorrow. You better not do anything bad to him, Mom. Or else, I will go number two on you. <laughs> Just love to make your mother proud, don't you, Kill? Oh, my special little boy. <sighs> I'm heading back to my room. Okay, Kill. Good night. <laughs> she better not do anything bad to him. Or else... Why can I have true love as well? Bye. <laughs>